Hey crafty friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I have this fun little project share featuring Scrap Diva Design's newest release. It will be available March 1st, so definitely be ready for it. I'll put the description, when I can, I'll put the links in the description box. So far I've been playing around with different collections. Definitely Easter vibes. <laughs> um, so for the, I have two projects to share. I'm going to share the ones with the Easter, well, it's the bunny slash doily because of the doily ship here, uh, memory decks, and then the bunny, the Easter bunny, which I absolutely love you guys. It is so cute. So you guys saw me share this set here uh, in the last video, I think, that I posted or the one before this, I can't remember. And I finally added the little charm i found it in my stash i think it's so perfect the colors match and the gold it's so cute i did um layer up the little paws or feet here on some foam i had this little pom-pom comes from the dollar tree it came with like a muted tone um pom-poms the little ears i was gonna do some stitching but i got lazy and didn't i probably would have been cuter with some stitching but anyways the paper collection that i used for this one is cedar lane by american crafts and i picked it up a tuesday morning and i've had it for a long time and that's what i used also for the the basket so it was um all kind of goes together love the way it looks and i use some little beads from happy crafter shop i'll link her um shop in the description box because i think she still had some available and her release will also be May, March 1st. So you guys better be ready because her stuff always runs out. Okay, now for this one. Oh my gosh, I love this one. This little duck is so cute. Okay, so this is my friend Bobby's um, shop, uh, French Door Studio. She has this listing up on her Etsy shop. I'll put it in the description box. And it is the cutest. It comes with, I think, five sheets in it. And it's only like three something. That's pretty cheap. So uh, I played around with it and I absolutely love it. Oh my gosh, the colors are so cute and the vintage vibes. I love it. You guys know I love vintage. So this is the first project I used creating um, something with it and it's the memory decks. I fussy cut out some of the wording. I did shrink this down. So it comes with um, a few. I already cut into it. You guys look at this. So it came like this and I cut the bunny out because I have another project I'm working with. So it comes with your sheet that has all the little wording, the um, little tickets. And then it comes with this like cute little card that you can make this into a card. And you could even put Easter Parade across here. And just simple little card if you want. This is one of the full sheets of paper you get. And then the stripe one. This one I shrunk it down. Um, or not shrunk it down. I did four to a sheet on my printer so that I could cut out the little um, spring word here. And then I added these flowers from my stash. I got these on a D stash, but I think you can find these on AliExpress. They're just dried paper flowers. And then I did layer up the little bunny on this um, part here. This is just the fabric that I found in it match, not fabric, but they're like, I don't even know where I got them from. Oh, I got them from my um, stepmother-in-law's mom used to do a lot of sewing and she, they gave me all her stuff some of her stuff not everything and this was in there and it just matched the polka dot so I had to include it so cute I just love it and then the little eggs back in here super cute and simple you guys like you could do so many different other things okay and then the other thing that I did with the bunny oops let me show you let me put this and move this around is that i had this big egg that was made out of chipboard and i couldn't remember where i picked it up and i realized that i had purchased a foam um, package of eggs from dollar tree or target one of the two and so it came with a bunch of foam but i kept the cardboard part from the back and decided to make this jumbo egg which I love it. Oh my God, I love it. It's simple, but I think it's so pretty. Um, here's the big rabbit. I did just use the outside layer one and I um, cut it out using fabric. So this rabbit here is made out of fabric and I layered it with um, interfacing. It is like, I don't know if I have it. I think I put it away already. I'm sorry. I just picked it up by um, half 
half yard, I think, at Joann's. And it's fusible, but it kind of comes apart after a while. So that's why I did some stitching. I do have um, interfacing that you bond in heat bonds. And I use that one every now and then when I'm going to do more like layering it onto paper. But this one, I just, I was going to use it as a coaster, but then I found this egg in with my Easter stuff. And I just thought this is so perfect to make something with it. And so I cut out the printed paper that comes with the collection. And I had this white, this chipboard that's just like brown and white. I don't even know where I got this, but I decided to cut it out so I traced this egg so now I can reuse this and keep it and then I glued my paper and I inked it with some um, of this walnut stain and then I added my real pretty lace there I love that lace it's so pretty and then I added the bunny I did use some seam binding for uh, the bow there and then here's more of that word from the tickets from the collection and here's the bunny love this little bunny he's so chunky and cute and the pink oh it's so cute i love it i love it and i did layer him up so i cut off like around where the legs were and layered it up i thought about doing another layer but then i thought it might be weird if i just do like this part i don't know i didn't like the I, that idea but i might go back and cut this out with this and his head and layer it up We'll link all this stuff in the description box as soon as it becomes available the die sets and the collections i will definitely put that in there definitely be ready march 1st you guys scrapdivadesigns.com don't forget to use my discount code and walker 10 and thank you guys so so much for watching i appreciate it and i hope you guys have a good um week bye